We are following some breaking news out of the FDA. The agency has just approved a new highly effective HIV prevention medication. In clinical trials, the drug nearly eliminated the spread among people given an injection every six months. Joining us now with more NBC News medical fellow, Dr. Akshay Sayal. So Dr. Sayal, first tell us about this drug and why so many are excited about it. Hey, Zinclay, so this, this is a big deal. Uh, this just happened moments ago, the FDA approving a twice-yearly injection uh, to prevent HIV, the, the, the fatal virus that can cause the uh, disease known as AIDS. And Zinclay, why this is such a big deal? You know, when, when we see patients who want to, to take a pill to prevent HIV, what we have to prescribe is, is something called PrEP, or pre-exposure prophylaxis. It's something that you take, uh, you know, in hopes that if your body encounters the virus, it should be able to stop it. Uh, but Zinclay, the big problem with that is it's a daily pill. And, and the most common complaint I hear from my patients when I prescribe it is, do I really have to take it every day? And so that's what makes this announcement such a big deal. It's a twice yearly injection, works actually better than the daily pill. And Zinclay, if I may, I'll just read a, a quote here from a, a, a nonprofit HIV advocacy group that told our medical team, quote, this is the single best opportunity in 44 years of HIV prevention. So a lot to look forward to here. Wow, that is quite a statement. So how soon could people actually get access to the drug? So, Kate, a lot of that is, is still unclear right now, especially with, uh, you know, a lot of the governmental uh, cuts that are going on in terms of uh, resource allocation. But I, what I will say, you know, the, the next thing is, you know, is it, is it going to cost a lot, right? Is there going to be a lot of copay and deductible coverage with this? Um, and so what we typically see when drugs get approved is that once they get approved or not until they get approved is when the FDA um, or when insurance companies start to weigh in in terms of how much the copay is going to be, you know, if they're going to prefer the cheaper generics, the daily pill I was talking about. So a lot, a lot of uncertainty still here, but a lot of excitement at the same time. We thank you for watching and remember stay updated on breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or watch live on our YouTube channel.